guys, happy Sunday. I decided to vlog today. On today's agenda is church, and then I have to go pick up my groceries from Walmart, and then I'm meal prepping. So, it's kind of, be like, it's kind of going to be a meal prep vlog. I'm not sure if my roommate's here, and I always feel uncomfortable vlogging if she's here, because the kitchen's like right by her room. So I'm gonna meal prep, but I'm not sure if she's here or not, so I might not talk. But yeah, um, it's 8.30, I gotta leave for church in like 20, 30 minutes. Um, yeah, I'm gonna put my hair up later. I'm just waiting for it to kind of get dry. Cause then if I put it up when it's wet, it still is wet the next day, which I really don't care about, but kind of, I'm not sure if it's good for my hair. Here is my outfit. I was gonna wear shorts and then I thought it looked weird with this. So I have on this striped green and white top from Walmart. It's pocket tee, it was like seven bucks. I thought it was really cute, so I got it. And then I just have on jeans. That's the plan for today. I will see you guys when I'm going to church. I need to stop parking underneath this tree because I get all of these little things on my car. And I just got my car washed. So it's quite annoying. But, um, I'm here in a low bun. I feel like the high bun's like chill Ashley, like uh, gym Ashley. And then the low bun's like bougie fancy Ashley. Um, you know, buns are kind of all I wear because like wearing your hair down when it's curly is just a lot. Yeah, I'm about to head to church. It's 8.55. Last week I was running late, but I kind of liked it because, like, I didn't have to sit there awkwardly because I go to church alone, if you guys didn't know. Um, you know, I mean, all my friends are at home because it's summer and I'm still at school. A, and B, like, they wouldn't come up with me anyway. They don't, they don't like, go to church, which is fine. <laughs> but it's just kind of weird. <laughs> and a lot of people ask me, like, oh, are you here alone? I'm like, yeah, but they're so nice. But I'm like, I'm fine with being alone. So I'm at pickup at Walmart. Um, the lady's coming really quick, so I'm just gonna put my camera down because that's gonna be awkward if she shows up my window and I'm talking to you guys. <laughs> What's the name? Ashley, Tobin. Oh, did you get to see your substitution today? Yes. Yes. Can you change this song here? Really? We have this. We're promoting our um, delivery. It starts tonight. Oh, okay. Um, and the postcard has a code on it for three free deliveries. Okay, thank you. Yes, please. This is not sponsored. I'm not that popular, but I love Walmart grocery pickup because you literally just come here, you park in a spot, and then they come. I pop the trunk, I don't get out, and they put my groceries in here. You have to order at my Walmart like a day ahead if you want the like, afternoon time, but maybe like a day and a half if you want a morning time. I just came right after church because it was a convenient time for me, and church is right by the Walmart that offers pickup, but I love it. It's so, so convenient. I don't have to go inside ever, and it just, it saves time. So if you have a Walmart that offers pickup, I recommend doing it. But now I'm gonna head home. It's 10.45, doing good on time, and I'm going to meal prep, maybe. I think so, like why not? Okay, so like I said, I, think my roommate's here i really have no idea so i'm gonna i haven't got my groceries out of the car because i go pee really bad but i'm gonna get those and then i, I guess i can't really do a grocery haul sorry um but i have three meals i'm making as i thought my roommate was home i decided to do a voiceover okay so here i have rotel black beans corn kiwis microwavable green beans tortilla chips, foaming hand soap so I can put it in my Bath and Body Works soaps, bananas, apples, mangoes, cilantro, turkey bacon, ground turkey, chicken, potatoes, Thomas's blueberry English muffins, steak, strawberries, and broccoli. Never giving up, no fight Not letting you out of my sight Never giving up, this time for real Oh, wake up, wake up Wake up, wake up Never giving up, no fight Not letting you out of my sight Wake 
never been good at show discretion. Okay, I have changed for the gym, finished marinating my food. That steak is a little bit scary because it's a fat piece of steak and I was expecting two, but they, I, guess, I guess I didn't have it. So I'm scared to cook it. I don't know how I'm gonna, but here is my outfit from white. I actually love this fit. I kind of don't like hats because like to actually get them off the ground, to actually get them to like, when they're like this, I feel like I can't see anything and also kind of looks dumb. But then, like, I don't know. I feel like that looks weird, too. I don't know. Anyway, I think it just is a good way to cover up your head. <laughs> and then my bun in the back. Um, bra is from Gymshark. It is the Fleur Texture in Charcoal Marl or Gray. I don't know. Here's the back. I think it's really cute. And these leggings, I used to never wear. And then one day, I just pulled them out. And I was like, oh, my God, I freaking love them. So these are Old Navy leggings. I freaking love Old Navy leggings. I mean, I think this was my only pair. I had one pair that I accidentally cut a hole in, <laughs> so I threw those away. But I freaking love them. I need to probably roll them up because I don't like the scrunchiness, but they have that cute detail on the ankle, I mean, on the calf. I think it's cute. And my shoes are really old and I need to replace them because they have a hole. They have a hole in the toe. But there are Adidas, like, cloud foam, fit foam, something like that. I think they're little boys, but I like them. They're my only gray shoes, so I have to wear them. Yeah. That's the fit. I might throw on a hoodie to go because I always like kind of start off with a hoodie and then I take it off. Um, today I'm filming, well, I'm filming an arms workout and then I'm doing a hit workout. We'll probably start filming and then I will do the hit workout. <sighs> I'm not sure I'm going to vlog. It depends how crowded it is. I think I've said this, so yeah. Filming that workout. Now I'm in the hydro massage room. I love this gym. As you can tell, I'm quite sweaty. You can probably see it on my booty. I haven't looked at it yet though. Let's see. <laughs> Can't do that. But yeah, I'm gonna do a hydro massage because I only like was here for like 30 minutes, so I should probably eat my workout. Okay. So I couldn't do it because it said like enter a passcode and I guess one two three four and zero 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 zero. Neither of them worked and I was like, how do I do this? I don't know. And I felt embarrassed, so I just walked out. And I could have foam rolled instead, but whatever. It's freaking hot. It is 91 degrees, but it doesn't feel like that. It feels like 5,000. And I'm so sweaty. Okay, I'm gonna go home, take a shower, eat lunch, and then meal prep. Okay, so I took a shower, ate lunch. It is now 2.18. Well, I guess I changed my mind and now I'm making everything. I'm about to make the potatoes and I put the steak on. Something smells like it's burning, but they're both really low, so I don't know why. But yeah, I'm gonna cut potatoes and make those. I thought that people would question me about those Swiss rolls. Those are my roommates, just so you know. I guess I'm making everything. I thought I'd make the chicken, so I'm making that. I'm not sure. I'm kind of nervous about it. it kind of scares me. That's still just kind of cooking together. I could take it off if I want to, but it's just on a really low heat. And I'm about to cut the steak, and the potatoes are still in there. Not letting you out of my side. Never giving up this time for real. I made these, I normally like medium well, but it just wasn't happening, so I don't really care. If I heat it up, it should be better. Turn that off. Um, so yeah, got three of them done. Potatoes are gonna go in here that just finished. And I'm making the chicken. And my taco soup is in the fridge. Okay, my last meal is almost done. It's 3.54, I feel like I did this really fast. Like normally I feel exhausted. I feel fine. I don't know what time I started. I think I told you guys, but I should probably turn that off. So, I think it's here, but 
It's just chicken and green beans. Never giving up, no fight. Not letting you out of my side. So all the dishes are done, everything's done meal prepping, and after I meal prep, I always feel like I need a good snack. So I'm about to have these. These are freaking bomb. I have them for breakfast too, but they're blueberry English muffins. They're amazing. I'm gonna pop in the toaster. It's gonna be great. I might have some strawberries or a banana on the side as well. Okay, so yeah, here is it. I have a really cheap toaster from Walmart because my roommate Keisha has one. And we're moving in in August, so I didn't want to buy one that was expensive. So I just got this cheap $10 one, and it keeps on, like, smelling like burnt. And these ones get, like, stuck, as you can see, and there's that little burnt piece. Really, really annoying. But these, I think, are better for you. They taste just like bagels, but they have less carbs, I want to say, more protein, I think. I don't really know. And then I have a protein shake. So this is Synergy, I think that's how you pronounce it, BSM Synergy Chocolate peanut butter protein i got it on amazon and then i just threw a uh, scoop of uh, greens from boma nutrition in here hi guys so i didn't end the vlog yesterday but i thought i would vlog today too because today is a fun day so i actually don't work today because it's orientation week and i work tomorrow morning so i have yoga at 8 30 i'm about to leave i have to finish eating the last couple of bites on my plate i wish i would have shown y'all i had chocolate kodiak cakes egg well just one egg and then bacon and turkey bacon and strawberries um but i'm about to go to yoga at the gym it's at 8 30 here is my outfit this is more like a gym workout than a yoga outfit but i don't really care so this is the um gymshark vital seamless dusky pink and then i just have this crop top on from forever 21 throw on some shoes and then after yoga it ends at 9 30 i have to rush back to school because at 10 i'm training a client with my boss I'm getting started with it. I don't get my certification yet, so we are training her for free, but once I'm certified, it'll be different, but I'm still getting paid, which is all that matters. But yeah, I'm gonna throw on my shoes. I think I'm gonna wear these ones. These are my Nikes. <sighs> Nike, I don't really know what they're called. Hey guys, so I went back, I got back from yoga, came back to school to train my client, and as I was walking into the gym on campus, I got an email from her saying that she had to meet with her professor and that she cannot come so i was kind of mad so i had to come back to my room grab my gym bag because i was going to just sit here and do nothing for the next couple hours so i had to come to my room i grabbed my gym bag and then i went back to the gym couldn't go to the school gym because it doesn't open until 11 or not so i don't like it so I went to the gym did legs left my camera here to charge and now we're back to present time it was a really good lift i didn't film it at all which i think is a reason why it kind of was so good sometimes filming it filming workouts especially by yourself is just really really annoying and it kind of gets you out of the zone if i have like a friend there then like i'm never really in the zone let's be honest um <laughs> so if someone's filming me then it's fine but if i'm filming myself it's just really annoying so i didn't film it but it was really really good okay so i've warmed up my food i just have this long lime chicken recipe and hopefully it's good but i'm going to set the camera down i guess while i taste this and tell you guys what's going on Ugh, one second let me turn on the light my summer job is like a summer ra so i'm on call we only have been on call for two weeks some people have three weeks but we're on call two weeks we have a duty partner on call i'm supposed to start on call today and i asked my on-call duty partner um what if okay so last time we were on call was in may i think and we did i did eight to eight in the daytime he did eight to eight at the nighttime but i realized by doing that it's freaking annoying because when i go to the gym first of all like who's gonna wake up at 6 a.m to go to the gym and then after eight i'm like getting ready for bed so i didn't want to have the phone all day because i would go to the gym but i have to go to the gym on campus which i do not like because if i go to the gym i normally go to it's too far away so i just couldn't i couldn't do it so i asked him if he wanted to switch it and i do eight to eight at night he does eight to eight in the morning and he's like i told you i can't do that because i work in the mornings and have a job now it's not my fault you have another job I have another job as well, but I make it work with being on call. You know, you can give up your shifts. His job isn't kind of the job like that, but whatever. It's not my issue that he has another job. My watch unlocked. Yes. 
so I was like well I'm not doing the whole day again I can't do that anymore because it's an inconvenience to me and he's like he tells me this whole long paragraph and then I replied and he didn't reply back so then I asked him this morning hey um we can do this and so we have a meeting with my boss at uh 12 30 today so we have our meeting soon I am not I feel like sometimes I'm too nice and I just let things slide but I'm not letting that slide because doing it every day 8 a.m to 8 p.m is freaking annoying tell y'all that because I wake up early and then I go to bed early so I only have like an hour without the phone in the morning and then an hour without and then he just has the whole day without the phone he just has it at night time which like I don't care about how many calls you're getting it's just like you're sleeping so like I don't know I don't like it so we have our meeting about that today I'm gonna eat my food I guess I'll go get a little taste test so cilantro lime rice green beans and the chicken this is good I'm a happy gal so I just got back from my meeting I did some dishes because I try and keep up with my dishes throughout the day it makes it a lot easier I used to hate dishes but now if you just get them done when you're done eating or like as soon as possible it's fine talking a lot with my hands but basically we switched it up and I got my way. I was super excited. It is 12.50. I did just eat, but I really, really want a snack. I got some fruit, like I said. I keep all my fruit in my room because the fridge outside like is a kind of small for two people. Well, like if I wanted to like stuff it, it would be fine, but I just don't want to. So in here I have kind of all my snacks. I should probably throw some of this out. I have cookie dough, first of all. Worst decision ever. I have cookies every day. <laughs> but down here I have some mangoes. I think I just have two of those. And then I have, no, I have three mangoes. I have some apples, which my go-to snack is always apples and peanut butter. But I'm going to try and change it up so I actually eat these other fruits. I have some celery down here, which I think is bad. First of all, it's browning. I kind of forgot about it. Yeah, I have some carrots in there, and then I have a meal prep container with carrots in it. I don't know why. I have some kiwis, which I kind of want. And then I have some grapes, which I should probably finish before they go bad. They're kind of always already going bad. So I'm going to snack on these whenever I get real hungry. But my thing is, whenever I'm not hungry, whenever I'm bored, I will snack. And I think a lot of y'all do that. So I'm going to try and make myself not bored. I'm not sure how to, like in the summer when you're not working. Because I don't work today. I used to get the phone at 8. So I don't know. All right, so I'm eating dinner. I wanted to show you guys this. This is the last meal I have to eat. I Since I make three meals a week, I always kind of, it's nice having three instead of two or just one. Because if you have one, you're eating the same thing every day. And if you have two, you're eating the same lunch and dinner every day. You know what I'm saying? So when I have three, I can switch it up. So yesterday I had taco soup for dinner. Today I had the chicken for lunch and I'm having the steak for dinner. And then tomorrow I can have taco soup for lunch and the steak for dinner. And, you know, I can switch it up. So it's not really the same. It tricks my body. And then I get, like, I don't get used to eating the same thing. So, I'm going to show you guys it. It is delicious, honestly. I poured just a tiny bit of steak sauce on here. I'm going to add broccoli, some ketchup, but she's probably too much. And I'm watching YouTube. So, I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog right here because I constantly forget. So, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you guys want to see full workouts, I post those on my Instagram. They're swipe workouts, so they're really easy to follow in the gym. And, yeah. Hope y'all enjoyed, and I'll see y'all in my next video. Uh, also, comment down below what kind of videos you guys want to see. I'm definitely going to be vlogging some fun things that are up and coming, like my birthday weekend. And then the weekend after my birthday weekend, I'm going to Atlanta. So, See you guys in my next video. I do not want to give you more of my life.